Welcome to Billy's Boot Camp. This is Al Boot Camp today. Are you guys ready to get down today? Are y'all ready? Okay, we're gonna start it off with slimming exercises first. Right from slimming, right to knee raises. From knee raises all the way down to the floor, doing stomach crunches. Are y'all ready? All right, count it out. One and two, count it. Now what we're gonna do here now is the basic slimming exercises. It's called the twist. Now get those elbows up. Let your hands be on your side. We're gonna twist those shoulders where you meet that center line. I'm gonna walk over the shoulder and show you what I'm talking about. Remember, as you go, as you start to do the twisting exercise, you want your shoulders to always cross your center line. If the shoulders cross that center line, you have an imaginary center line in front of you. Left shoulder gotta cross the center line. Hips gotta stay isolated. You don't want those hips moving back and forth. Try to move those hips back and forth. You don't want your hips to be moving like that. Keep those hips isolated and you'll be all right. Here we go. One more set, go. Everybody count, sound off, sound off, let's go. Twist, now, slow it down, we go. One, bring it back, bring it back. Now you feel the contraction. You'll feel a little stretch in your back, right in your lats. Now hold that stomach in, come on. One more time, go. Shoulders go across. Remember, some people might be swinging their arms. You don't want to swing those arms. Take that shoulder across the center line. Here's your center line. Bring your shoulder to the center line. One more set, go. Count it. And remember, your head stays solid. Keep the head like a top. You got my hand on your head. Only thing that's moving is, is the shoulders. Shoulders are moving. If the shoulders are moving, you'll be all right. One more time. Go. Slimmy. Count it. That's it. Are you ready to speed it up? A little bit of cardio behind it. Come on. Tighten those abs up. Now twist. Go. Count it. Down off. Come on. Let's go. Work it. Come on. Twist. Again. Twist it, twist, twist, twist it, twist. One more time. Let's go. Now take it down to the floor. Give me a nice twist. Keep those eyes up. Twist. Moving those shoulders. As you can see, Shelly's shoulders going back and forth. Going across that center line. Remember, you have a center line in front of you, right? And as you take the shoulder across the center line, you want to pull your abs in. One more time. Go. Count it out. Go. Count it. Count it. At the same time, bring it back up to the top. Shoulders are up. There you go. Good job. Come on, hold it tight. Come on. Count it. Count it. Count it. Count it. Now hold. We go. Twist. Bring it back. Bring it back. Put it on the waist. A little bit on the back. Bring that arm to the center. Bring it to the center. Bring it to the center. One more time. Go. Got to twist those abs. Twist those abs. Now at the same time you're twisting those abs, you want to blow the air out. As you count, the air will come out of your body and your stomach will be contracted. Don't not count. I want everybody to count. Was that good English or was it okay? Okay, yeah, it was good English. But anyway, you guys go ahead and make sure you make that count, all right? Count it out. Let's go. One more time. Go. Count it. Count. And now take the arm. Now take the head around. Turn and look. Turn. Turn and look. Turn. Now you got a bigger twist. Bigger twist. Bigger twist. Hold the center. Now, one, twist, twist. Bend those knees. Now you feel it in those abs. You're really going to feel it in those abs. Now watch. I'm pulling over the Shelly. Watch your abs. Hands are straight. Make sure your hands like an airplane. Hands like an airplane. Let's go. Twist those abs. Twist, 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 twist. All right, come on out of that now. All right, that's called slimming. Remember, that's a good way to bring the waist in. A good way to strengthen the waist is what we can do now. Put the left leg out. Arms go up now. We're going to take the hips in up first. Left heel comes up to the ceiling. Hands stay up. Leave the arm up in front. Now bring the hip up. I'm going to walk over to Jillian and show you what I'm talking about. Now keep the hand up. Don't move the shoulder. Let's bring the hip up. 
Now as the hip goes up, as the hip goes up, we're gonna be contracting those abs. The arm has nothing to do with this right now, I just want the hips to come up. I'm like pushing against their hips, okay? Pushing against those hips. One more time, push it. Hands are up. Squeeze those abs. Squeeze those abs. Squeeze. You gotta squeeze. You're gonna hold on eight this time. Hold on eight. Squeeze. Now hold on eight. Hold on eight right there. Hold on eight right there. Now, now the arm comes down. Keep your hips in one position. Now bring the arm down. Let's go. One. Bring your shoulders over. Remember, shoulders gotta move. But the hips don't move. The hips don't move. The hips do not move. Keep those hips isolated. That's it. Keep those hips isolated. That's right. Now bring the armpit right over. As you remember, the arm can't move by itself. You want the, you want the armpit to come over the top of the hip. But keep those hips in one position. There you go. Bring it all the way over. Bring one more set of these. Now you're going to do double time. What I mean by double time, you're going to bring the hips to the elbow, elbow to the hip. Keep on. Come on, guys. Are y'all ready? Now both move together. Open up, go. Bring the hip over. Bring the arm over. Squeeze those ass. Remember, as you count, you let the air out of your body. That's the air coming away from your body. That, that means you have a good contraction. If you don't want to count, blow the air out. Blow the air out. Bring the armpit down. Bring the hip up. Hip up, armpit down. I'll walk over to Jillian, show you what I'm talking about. Come on, pull it. I'm going to push against this arm. Push against this arm. See how your hips goes? She push the hips up. Push your arms down. One more set. Count it. Squeeze those abs. Squeeze. Squeeze. One more set. Go. Squeeze it. Squeeze it. Squeeze it. Squeeze it. Squeeze. That's it. Seven. Squeeze. Back to the center. Go. Come on. Center. Come on. Center. We're doing trimming, trimming, trimming. Now, guys, if you're at home, all you need to do, too, is take a broomstick, put it around your neck, and give me a nice little twist. That will also isolate the stuff a little more. Count it. Work it. Work it. One more time. Go. Count it. Count it. Count it. Count it. Now bring those legs up. Now arm up. Reach up. Bring your hip up. Up. Right hip goes up now. Squeeze those abs. That hip up, up into the ear, up into the ear. Squeeze those abs. I'm pushing against it. Push. Now the arm don't move. Keep the arms suspended in the air. Push. Squeeze those abs. Now see what Shelly's doing here? Think of an imaginary wall there. You're going to push against those abs. That's that's right. Squeeze. Same thing over here with jeans. See your abs? Same thing. So you push it against the hip. As you push the hips up, the hips come up, and you're contracting those abs. That's good. You're doing good. Let me watch you do it. Come on. That's it. Come on. Work it. Now blow the air out. Count. And blow the air out. There you go. Keep it going. Good job. Come on. Work it. Now the arm goes down. Keep the hips solid. Keep those hips solid. Squeeze those abs. Squeeze. Now watch. I'm going to push against it. I'm going to push from here. So I'm pushing from the top, and you got to pull down. Now remember, don't just move your arm. The armpit got to go over. The armpit. Bring the armpit over the top of the hips. There you go. You want to feel that contraction. Now at the same time you do that, you're also going to feel it in your back. So your rectum muscles in your back are going to get to work out too, along with the hips. And also, don't, don't forget this. Even your buttocks still going to get a little bit too. But right here, we're working the abs. Squeeze. That's it. Squeeze it. One more of these, y'all. Squeeze. The hips don't move. Now tighten those arms up. Now the hips gonna move. Move your hips. Squeeze those hips. Armpit goes over the top. Over the top. Bring it over the top. Come on, squeeze. I can hear y'all guys. Bring it over the top. All the way over the top. Over the top. One more set of these. One more set. One more set. Strong. Bring the arm down. Bring it lower. Bring the hips up. Bring the right. Bring the arm down a little bit lower. There you go. A little bit lower now. Lift the hip up. Hold on eight. Hold on eight. Shouldn't be able to pull you apart. Shouldn't be able to pull you apart. Look. Shouldn't be able to pull you apart. Yes, that's what I'm talking about. Shouldn't be able to pull you apart. Hold it there. Hold it tight. Good job. Walk it out. Twist. One, two. Twist it. Twist. Back to Slimmy. Come on. Slimmy. What are we doing, guys? Slimmy. Come on. Come on. Have boot camp. That's what we're doing. Let's go, guys. Come on. Sound off. Go. One, two, three, four, five, six. Seven, eight, sound off. One, two, come on, y'all. Come on, y'all. Yeah, yeah. One more set. 
Count it, count it, count it, and bring it down. Okay, we're going from the side, lean over to the side, put the arms up here. Now you left side ass by himself. Take your arm up here, you're gonna pull down, hold, and back. Two, remember, resist both ways. Remember, anytime you lift your knees up, they have to go above the belly button. When the abs, when your knee go above the belly button, then you're working those abs. Come on, now I want the contraction. One more. Squeeze those abs. Now see how Shelly's arms separate from her knee? As soon as her hands touch the knee, they separate from each other. That's what brings the ab work in there and the contraction. So separate. Separate and explode back out. One more time. There you go. Really give me that explosion. Good. Way to work it. Come on. Feel the burn. Feel the burn. Feel the burn. Good job. Walk it out. All right. Now, that was individual ab. Now you're going to do make it aerobic, okay? Aerobic abs. Now, pull the hand up. You got to feel that contraction. Watch me first. We're going to go one. Pull it. Two, pull it, ready, five, six, everybody count, go, one, pull it, you gotta pull it, you gotta pull those hands down, that's it, pull it, feel it in your left side, left side is getting all the work, right side has nothing to do with it right now, that's the left side, count it out guys, let those hands separate, let the knees separate, but don't bounce off the floor, that's it, that's it, that's it, there you go, come on, don't let it bounce off the floor, good job, all right, let's go back and slim, Back to slimming, yeah. Come on. Come on. Work it. Now get a little lower. Work those legs. Come on. Isolate those abs. Work it. Work it. That's it. Come on. Work it. Come on. Work it. Yes. A little bit lower. A little bit lower. Pull your stomach in. There you go. Hold that stomach in. That's it. Come on. Twist. Give me a bigger twist. Good. Oh, you feel it in your back? Then don't go as far. Just take your time and feel it. When you start to go to the point where you start to feel like you're pulling the muscle in your back, easy up and make it lighter. There you go. All right. One more. Count it. Count it. Count it. Count it. Count it. All right. Hold to the right side. Now bring your hands up. Again, remember, individual contraction, individual abs, individual knee raise. Ready? We go. And one. Pull it. You're going to pull those hands down. Pull your hands down and let it separate from the knee. You want to pull it. Feel the contraction. Now listen to your voice as you do this workout. Count it. You should feel the difference. Pull it. Pull. Pull the hand in. Knee goes up. Now separate them. That's it. Fill in the hands. One more time. That's it. You're doing a good job. Come on, fill it in the abs. Fill in the abs. That's it. Come on, y'all. Good job. All right, walk it up. Okay, this is boot camp abs, guys. You know what it is. What is it? Ab boot camp. All right, here we go. Now, keep those legs moving. Now, left leg goes down in front. Hold it right there. Place your hands on top of here. Don't grab your neck. We'll place it on the outside. You're going to pull your knee up. You're going to do this. You're going to contract your abs. The elbows go in. Contract. Come on. Push those elbows in. You want to contract those abs. Contract. Come on. You want to round your back. At the same time you round your back, you want to do what? Blow all the air out of your abs. Blow all the air out of your abs. Feel the contraction in the abs. Push with those elbows. Push. That's it. Bring my hands on the outside and inside your elbows, and you want to push my hands toward me. Push in. At the same time, lift up your pelvis, round your back, and squeeze those abs. That's it right there. Keep that focus. Squeeze. Squeeze. One more set. Go. Squeeze it. Don't come out of it too fast. Don't come out of it too fast. Come out of it nice and slow. Hold on eight. 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 And remember, you shouldn't be able to open those arms up. You shouldn't be able to push your shoulders out. Hold it tight. One more time. Now from that position right there, aerobically, aerobically, go. Hold that. Hold that contraction. That's it. Hold that contraction. Make it burn. Make it burn. There you go. Yes, you got it. Keep on moving. Come on. Work it, work it. Good job, bring it down. All right. Now remember, what I mean by don't come out of it too so fast. Here, Shelly, keep moving, Shelly. What I mean by that, don't come out of it so fast, don't come out of it, this is too fast. This is too fast. Come out of it slow. You want to feel that contraction. Feel the contraction. Now right leg goes forward again. Ready? Now let's do the right side. Pull your toes towards you. Flex those quadriceps. Hold your hands here. Ready? Everybody ready? Let's go. Squeeze. One. Come out of it slow. Slow. Contract, 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 a little bit slower, a little bit, yes, yes, a little bit slower. Now blow the air out of your ass, blow all the air out of your ass, how 
tell you to do that, you can either do it by counting or just go floating around your ass. Same time, push your pelvis up to the ceiling, bring those elbows in like somebody's pushing against it. There you go. Come on, work it. One more set, go. Give me a nice squeeze. 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 Hold it right there. Hold. Hold it tight. Hold it tight. Now let me hear everybody count tight. You hear the way I'm sounding right now? Holding those abs. One, two, one, three. Don't pull on your neck. Keep the fingertips on the side of your head. Count it. Squeeze those abs. Tighten those abs up. Tighten those abs up. Now double, go. Tight, tight, tight. Don't let go of those abs. Come on. You're gonna feel a little bit in your back. You're definitely gonna feel a little bit in your back. Feel you yes, yes, you're gonna feel that stretch in your back as you're holding. One more, go. Count it, make it burn. Make it burn. Yes, yes, okay. Walk it out, good job. Good job, now let's give me a stretch with you guys. Stretch, man, nice stretch. Here's a good stretch again. And trimming, trimming and stretching. Come on, count it, count it, come on, count it. Bend the knees a little more, count it, count it. One more time, go. Count it, count it, count it. Work it, work it, come on, work it. One more, work it, come on, quit, quit. Now, place the hands on the side like this, fingertips, thumb up top, index on the, on the bottom. Now give me a nice twist, twist, come on, twist. Feel those abs, touch those abs, tighten them up, tight. Count it, that's it. Index finger, thumb, right here. And nice twist, twist. Remember, don't move your legs, you know, don't move those legs. Keep those legs solid, isolate those legs. There you go, right there, there you go. Hold it solid, yes. All right, good job, bring it down. All right, you guys done a good half boot camp. Good job, way to focus in. Remember, to change your half, you gotta focus in. All right, now go to position here. Left leg goes out to the side, now put your right hand up here. Now you're gonna pull the left, the right elbow into the center part of your body. At the same time, bring that knee across and touch it. So you work those abs on the left side as well as the right side. Y'all ready? Nice and slow we go. One, bring it in. Squeeze. Remember, resistance both ways. Push against the knee, push in against the elbow. Push it, come on. Squeeze it. Yes, there you go. One more time. There you go. Now remember, don't pull on your neck. Put the fingers on the side of your head. There you go. Get us neck strength. Keep the fingers outside. There you go. One more set of these. Feel the contraction. Feel that contraction. Feel the contraction. Yes, there you go. Come on, hold. Hold on eight. Hold on eight. Hold on eight. Hold it. Yes, hold it. Feel that contraction. Feel it. Feel it. Feel it. Now back to twist. Go. Twist. Twist. Time, go. Now we're about to be ready. Get ready. Go down to the ground. Are you ready? Come on, y'all. Work it. One more time, guys. Count it. Work it. Come on. Work it. Work it. Yes. Now slide the left leg in. Left hand on the side. Here we go, guys. Hands up. Now give me a nice twist. Hands on your ass. Twist. One. Remember, bring it in the angle. Don't bring it straight up. Bring it across any angle. I'm going to walk over to Jill and show you what I'm talking about. Come on. You don't want to do this. Bring it straight up. Don't bring it straight up. Bring it in the angle. Think of my hand down in front of you like this. Bring it across. There you go. Just like that. That's it. That's it. Come on, working. I bring the elbow all the way across. Remember, resistance both ways. Resistance both ways. Push against the knee. Push with the elbow. I need one more set of these. Count it. That's it. Come on, work it. Work it. Last one, guys. Go. I need you to hold on this one. Count it. Feel those abs. Feel those abs. Don't pull on your neck. We're gonna hold on eight. Hold on eight. Hold on eight. Hold it. Yes, hold on eight. Hold on eight. Go the air out. Go the air out. Shouldn't be able to push. Shouldn't be able to push. Shouldn't be able to pull that shoulder apart. Hold it there. Yes, good job. All right. Bring it down. All right. Okay, now we're about to go down to the ground. When you go down to the ground, we're gonna do strengthening exercises as well as making that stomach strong. Your back also will become strong. So take your right leg down. Right leg goes down here, left leg goes down. Right. Place your hands down here, both hands. Right leg goes out to the side, left leg goes down on top. Place all the weight on your left, right elbow. Other hand goes here on top. Right, left leg goes up first. You're gonna lift it up to the side, you're gonna lift one at the same time. Now, as you do this, what the armpit doing? Armpit is going into the thigh, armpit is going into the thigh. That's it, come on. One more set, 
lift. Remember, you see me, I'm not pulling on my neck. You don't want to pull on your neck. Leave the hand on the side of your head. And you really, really want to country on your left side of your ass. You feel a little bit in your back, but that doesn't mean you're hurting yourself. You're working a muscle that you never worked before. Come on, count it. Now pick your heel up. The heel goes up. The heel, not the toe. Now, now both legs go up. Both legs goes up. That's it. Good job. Way to work it. Come on. Now lift that leg straight up in the air. Straight up in the air. That's it. Come on. Now, sometimes you don't have to have the leg fully extended. You can just pull those legs in a little bit and pull them in a little more. And re remember, when you're doing side ab, rock back on your butt cheek. You don't want to be laying on your hip bone. Lay on your butt cheek where you have some meat and some cushion. One more set. Ready? Lift it straight up. That's it. There you go. Come on. Good job. Yes. All right. Now pivot to the front side like this. Hold this position here. Now you're going to lift your right leg up and left leg here. Now don't fully extend the legs. Drop the knee. The knee. Remember, the bottom of the knee goes to the carpet. That's it. Right to the floor. There you go. Good job. Come on. Work it. Work it. Come on. Work it. Work it. One more set. Go. Now drop those elbows down so you don't feel any pressure in your back. And round your back. Remember, when you're doing a leg lift, you got to round your back. Tuck your chin in. You don't want your chin sticking up. Your chin should be tucked into your chest. Tuck it in. One more set. Go. See, not a straight leg. Push your knee down to the floor. Lift the knee up to the ceiling. Now that's all abs. Round your back. Now remember, if you feel it in your back still, come up a little higher. There you go. Work it. One more time. Go. Count it. Work those abs. Come on. Count it. Count it. Good job. Slide over to the right side. Good job. All right, now we got your left elbow down. Should be up underneath the shoulder blade. All right, place your right hand on top of the head. Legs go in front. Lift up your right heel. Let's go. And lift the heel. Lift the heel. That's it. Lift the heel. Heel. Lift the heel. Lift the heel. Lift the heel. Lift the, heel. the heel is coming up. And bring the armpit. The armpit goes into the heel. Right into the thigh here. And the thigh goes into the armpit. One more time. Lift it up. Lift it up. Two. Little pressure. That's it. There you go. Push it. See, I'm resisting, making a resist. There you go. Both legs up. Go. Both legs up. Remember, the legs don't have to be out so far. Bring those legs in a little bit closer. There you go. Right there. Now you got it. Now you're in the groove. Way to work it. There you go. Come on. You're doing a good job. One more set. Go. That's it. Work it, guys. Good job. Come on. Work those abs. Work those abs. Work those abs. Come on. Good job. Bring it back. Bring it back across the line right here. Now, again, we're going to lay down. Listen, guys. When people do stomach crunches, sometimes they have a tendency to lay the whole back on the floor. When you lay your whole back on the floor, you have a tendency to round your back and you swing. What you do is put your back on the floor. Everybody do this right now. Put your hands in the air. You guys at home, put your hands in the air. Place your fingers on your abs. Your abs are tight. Your abs are soft right now, right? Okay, now lift your chin up. Pull it to your, right to your chest. Shoulders off the ground. Now the abs should be contracted right now. Everybody's abs contracted? Okay, now hands out in front. Now you can go up. Now shoulder blades don't touch. You got to do this. Count it. Everybody count. That's it. Now shoulder blades don't touch. You're doing a good job right now. Remember, your head is so far away from the center part of your body. Every time you do a sit-up or any type of nap exercise, it's going to cause a reaction in your neck. But that doesn't mean that you're pulling a muscle. That means your neck has to get used to Your body has to get used to picking up your head. In this position is the only time that your body really picks up your head. So you got to work on it, and the more you strengthen your neck from doing this exercise, the more that neck starts to go away. Count it. Feel the burn. Feel the burn. Feel the burn. Yes. Feel the burn. One more. Count it. That's it. How you guys feel out there? Come on. One more time, go. Count it, count it, yes. Count it, count it. Now hold it up there, hold it, now hold it. Now blow all the air out of your stomach, right now. Blow all the air out of your stomach. All the air should be out of your stomach. Now hold it right there, you should be feeling that burn now. Now start from right there, now go up from there. Don't go lower, but go up higher, come on. Count it, count it. Now, now you really got them abs contracted. See the, the shoulder blades not touching the ground anymore. You're not stretching. You're doing a good ab workout. I guarantee you, after this ab workout, your stomach gonna feel like a rubber band. That's what you want. 
All you women at home that got the lower stomach problems, watch and see what happens. You're gonna start pulling that stomach up, and it's gonna snap tight the way you wanna make it snap tight. All right, keep it up. Come on, count it, count it, count it, count it, count it, count it. Good job, give me a stretch. Give me a nice stretch. Here's a good way to stretch it out. You know, you do abs, you wanna get a nice stretch at the same time. Stretch it out here. Six. One more time, go. That's it. Count it. All right, good job. Now, bring it up. Place your hands on the side. Now, place your legs over to the side. Take your left leg to the side. Take your right leg. Place it on top of the left knee. Just like this, okay? Put the left leg in. Place the fist on the side of your head. Then you take your elbow over. Touch. That's it. Now, remember, those at home that can't do this exercise, just keep your left leg bent and bring it over. Or bring the right leg up. By itself. Okay, then once you become stronger, then attach both of them to each other, and then you'll get the same type of workout you've seen everybody else do out here. You might see some of these guys modify a little bit, that's okay. Go ahead and modify it enough where you still can get strong and be strong, okay? Come on, count it, guys. Count it. Squeeze those abs. Squeeze. Squeeze. Now the same thing, resistance. I'm pushing against her legs. Making her pick those legs up. Pushing against her elbows. Push. Working on just the left side by itself. Left side by itself. That's it. Good job. Now switch over to the other side. Let's go back to the other side. You guys are doing a good job. Doing a good job out there, guys. Okay, here we go. Left leg goes on top of the right. Pull the right leg back. Place the right fist up. Now you're going to lift. Lift. Lift it up. Two. Lift. Can't hear you count. Let me hear you count. Now, sometimes we're going to do it like this. I might say pick it up a little bit, okay? If I say double, you don't want to swing it. You want to pick it up and you want to do this. Watch Julianne. Shall I still keep the pace? Well, watch Julianne. I'm going to have her double, double, double. See what she's doing here? She's not losing that contraction. Every once in a while, go ahead and do that while you're doing a workout. Go into that double mode and then you'll really feel the burn there, okay? But right now, go back to the stretch. Go back to the stretch. That's it. This is the way to start it. Yes. Good job. All right. Bring it back to the front. All right. Here we go. Now, cross your legs. Lift your knees up here. Place the fingertips on the side of the head. Don't grab. Don't cuff your hands. Put them behind your neck. Put them on the side of the head. Now, the elbows go up. And touch. Touch. Touch the outside of the knees. But don't, please, don't pull on your neck. You don't want to pull on your neck. Just keep those fingertips on the side. Train yourself to put those fingertips on the side of your head. Count it. Come on. Again. Count it. Count it. Count it. Count it. Now slow it down, go one, two, down easy. See, I like the slow stuff first. And then after we do the slow stuff, we get right into the fast stuff. But right now, I'm just concentrating, feel the burn, feel the contraction. Now remember, pull those elbows in. You wanna squeeze those abs like you did the standing abs. You wanna pull those legs in and squeeze those abs. Come on, there you go. Come on, guys. Count it. Count it. Count it. Count it. Count it. That's it. Come on. One more. Good job. Place your hands down. Place your hands up to the ceiling. Here's a good way to do abs all the way up now. I want your knee to come up. Both knees come into the middle part of your body. The palms touch the ground. You go one, back down. Look what I'm doing here, guys. Shoulders off. Shoulders off the ground. Shoulders off the ground. One, touch. Shoulders don't touch. We'll walk on the show. You show what I'm talking about. Now if I put my hands underneath her like this, see? Shoulders are not touching the ground. The back is round, the stomach is contracted. The stomach is contracted. Remember, the stomach is contracted. Now, watch Shelly. Most people do this. Straighten out your back, Shelly. They straighten their back out, then all of a sudden the neck pull starts to come in, and the back ache starts to come in. But round your back. Round the back. There you go, just like that. Okay? Give me one more set, please. Count it. I'm gonna stick my hand up underneath your back. All right, now, come on, try it. Put my hand up underneath your back. Keep the back round. Count it. That's it, count it, count it. When you start to give up, guys, count out loud. Force yourself to do what you want, don't want to do. That's it, good job. All right, now let's take it into a, a little bit of a bicycle. A little bit of a bicycle, are you ready? Place it here, hands up to the side, bicycle. Go, one, two, nice and easy. Come on. Keep moving, come on, let's go. Keep on moving, that's it, keep moving. Move that stomach, come on, back and forth. There you go, work those abs. Make it burn. AJ, what you doing over here? What you doing over here? 
Come on, let me see it. Let me see. Count it. Count it. Count it. Let's go. Count it. Make it burn. That's it. Count it. Count it. Yes. One more set, guys. Count it. Count it. Count it. All right. Good job. Okay, here we go. Here's a new one. Arms are up. Keep your arms up here. Now we're going to give a stretch and a sit up at the same time. Watch me first, then you guys will try it. One, open the legs up. Give me a nice. See my shoulders don't touch the ground. Shoulders are off the ground. Touch. Back down. Ready? Place your hands up. Everybody count on with me. We go. One, back down. Two, watch your back. Shoulders are off the ground. I can't hear you guys count. I can't hear y'all count. Come on. There you go. Count it out. Let's go. Come on, guys. Count it. Let me see you do it. Let me see you do it. There you go. Count it out. Let me hear you guys count it out. I can't hear y'all. I think it's going to be push-ups time. If y'all don't start counting out, then it's going to be push-ups time. Don't force me to make y'all do 100 push-ups. Do y'all want to do 100 push-ups? Then I can't hear you. You got to sound off. I still can't hear you. What are you doing at home? Are you sounding off? Good job. Come on. All right. Bring it down. That was good. Okay, bring it up. Pull your left leg, right leg in. Left leg in. Here's another good one for the lower stomach. Lower stomach. Place your hands here. Pick the legs up. Now let's do this. One, two. Pump it in. Pump it in. Pump. Pump it in. That's it. Remember, don't pull on your neck. Don't put your hands on your neck. Keep the hands on the floor. Once you get a little advanced, then you can't put your hands on your neck. Right now, it's going to keep your hands down. Five, six, one more set. Go. Count it. Good. Come on. Work it. And drop it down. Good. Hold it right there. Keep the hands here. We're going to finish up with some power. Some power abs right now. Are y'all ready? Okay, left leg goes up. Now remember this, when you do this exercise, you're gonna feel a little bit in your back, because right now your back might not be used, used to this exercise. So let me tell you, just make sure when you guys do this exercise, you wanna keep the back round. Very important that you keep your back round. Anytime you're doing an abdomen exercise, you wanna keep your back round. If you wanna tighten those abs up, don't straighten the back all the way out, because if you do, you're gonna, all you're gonna do is stretch your abs, and then when you relax your stomach, it's gonna hang. Keep it in a relaxed mode. I mean, keep it in a round mode, and you keep it to that position. And then all of a sudden, when you stand up straight, the abs go boom. They pull tight, okay? That's what we're doing with the contraction. So lift that leg up, straighten your leg out. Now put your other leg up, straighten your leg out. Now, round your back. Roll back, now slightly, if you have to bend the knees, bend the knees. You wanna hold it, put your hands up now. Now you should be on your, your butt cheeks. Round your back, you round the butt cheeks. Now you're gonna feel a little bit in your quadriceps too. That's okay, but that's the way we gotta start. Come on, now remember, if you have to drop your leg down, go ahead and drop it down. But when you start to feel the pain a little bit, start to count out louder. Scream. And then if you have to rest, go ahead and rest. And then come back and do it over again, okay? Don't quit. Don't be a quitter. You can do this. Come on. Count it. Count it. Count it. Count it. One more set. Go. Count it. Count it. Count it. Count it. Count it. Count it. And drop your feet down. Good job. Now take the left leg over. Bring it over. Come on, guys. Real fast. Hands are up. Reach out in front, give me a nice stretch, way over to the top, count it. One, count it. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Good job, walk your hands in, pull your legs in. Take the right leg, left leg, I'm sorry, left leg, pull it to the rear. Right leg is bent, lean back, give me a nice stretch on the abs. Rock back on your right elbow, keep that knee down, you feel a little bit stretch in your abs here and your quads. Hold that stretch, count it, count it, count it, count it, that's it. All right, now bring it up nice and easy. Push up off those arms. There you go. Switch your legs around. Stretch the right side abs out. Now reach back and grab the foot. Lay back on that elbow. Let this elbow hold you up. Keep this leg lay on the ground where you feel that stretch all across this area. Count it. That's it. Count it. There you go. Now bring it up. Bring both legs out in front. Take your right leg and cross your left leg. Right leg, cross your left leg. Put it across. Pull that left leg through and stand up. All right. Good job. Good job. Pull your hands here, push them down. Let's go for a nice stretch in the rib cage. Hands go up, hands go behind the ears. Nice rib cage stretch. Push it in. Pull it back. One more time. In. Push it out. Take a bow. Bring it together, y'all. 
Listen, guys, this is Ab Boot Camp. Ab Boot Camp is a workout that's specialized just to get your abs in shape. And remember, when you're in the military, you have to lose yourself to gain some. Remember, especially with the exercising program, get into an exercising program, you can't think about yourself because if you do, then you'll give up and you'll quit. Lose who you are as a person. What I mean by that is you can do it, but you can't do it if you don't lose yourself. I mean, if you lose yourself, you'll get your goals. So we're here to help you out, all of us. We're your partners. Yes. We're your teachers. And we, we help you guide yourself, but we need your help too. God bless y'all. Keep up the good work and have a blessed day. Yeah. Yeah.